Welcome, lost in random time. And there's a bloob up here, which we need a bloob for this guy over here with the split head and split personality, literally. Some of us are and, to sleep. and this thing uh, is asking for help with a bloob. You can't hear that, can't you? That noise! Uh, dang it. I'm oh, he's got a different chin than the other ones. Bloob is up on my roof making a ruckus. I need, uh, what can I do? You'd do an old man's heart good if you could see your way to clearing those dang bloobs off my roof. All I want to do is nap. I'm old. Oh. I've spent more hours awake than anyone, and I deserve some moments of blessed unconsciousness. Yes. Quiet unconsciousness. Yes. You'll help me, won't you? I'll reward you or something. I'll see what I can do. Thank you, little one. You've made an old man's heart want to fill with hope, which will happen as soon as this old man's ears are no longer filled with cotton to keep that darn noise Ooh, down. Ooh, easy now. Don't dawdle now. You're as loud as that thing. Old. Oh, now I hear it. I'm old and I'm tired, and I demand you respect that. I don't know if it'll hit up there. Oh, it did. All right, so let's check the map. The, that's how the questions look in the map. Okay. Ding, 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 ding. All right, let's go get this bloob. So we need a couple of bloobs in order to split this guy's head. And somehow we also need to be able to uh, even... Come on, Dicey! Come on. There we go. Ah, look at that thing. Is that a language? Are you talking to me? Uh. Oh, oh shit. Perhaps the most useless creature in random, or so the powers that be would have us believe. <laughs> It not, it's not going to show us the bloobs. See, this has got like two little goldy things, but I think that's where I got the card. Goldy things. Yeah, there's side... Okay, there's five side quests here. Oh, we were at uh, Miami Supercon a couple... About a couple weeks back, and one of the things, and I've said it... Oh, yes. Uh, I've talked about the soundtracks being having a, a vibe of medieval. Where I saw a person dressed up as Sir Daniel Fortescue. He was. Uh, it, yeah, he made the... It looks like he made the head. Uh, the costume wasn't very armory, but it was a fun costume. And I appreciated seeing someone dressing up as Sir Dan. Because I, I, medieval does not get enough love. And I made a platinum video of medieval it's somewhere on my channel. Two towns in one. It's what we're known for. The new towns, the next big day. Bigger than anything ever. So now I think about it, it is pretty expensive public works project. Well, that was a lot to say. All right. Good dice, child. Yes, you. Come closer. Well, I don't want to. Why are they so child. creepy? I believe we can be useful to Lisbeth the Mysterious. Can you help me find my sister? She looks like me, I guess. Oh, not in a direct way. But there is something else you may be able to achieve in the meantime. You see, I've noticed that you have a dice with you. Dice with you? <laughs> it's a dog in a costume. Right. A good act, child. You'll need your wits to survive what's coming, I'd wager. 
So, let's say, hypothetically, you have a dice, which of course you don't, which means okay. you, hypothetically, have experience in their identification and a true nature. I've heard tell of a dice circulating Cellar Street. Of course, it's been so long since a true dice has been here. People don't entirely recognize it for what it is. <laughs> they just think it's BS. And if these rumors were true, well, I dare say you could be the one to find it. Okay. The folks dimly sense it has value. They treat it as something rare and unique. Say a fossil, not knowing its true value, its true nature. Nature. I believe someone like yourself could trade for it, or at the very least, trade up to it. Hypothetically, of course, and. If you did hypothetically succeed in possessing such a dice, well, I'd be interested, and I'd make it worth your while. Worth your while, indeed. How am I supposed to find a second dice? I've heard stories around Cellar Street. There's all sorts of strange items for trade there. And if you can't find it directly, you could trade until you do. I've told you all I can. Oh, except... Out with it. That's a lady. Except that I've heard whispers that someone is buying words. Oh, here we go. And someone else is selling them. Yes. And that would be where I'd start. Make yourself useful, child. Trade and trade until, before you know it, you've got your hands on one of those dangerous, awful, deadly dice. There. And then this. you give it to me, and I will take care of it. Ah, uh, you are extremely creepy. Look for people to trade with in Cellar Street. I will. I will. I mean, I already know. You've already kind of given me a bit of a hint about where to get some of that. Oh, that's the upside down. Okay, got to watch out for demigorgons in there. So you need a three. There's the Manny Dex. And lo, it was good. Oh dear, do I ever shut up? And lo, did the number two inspire all to praise the queen for twice as long? And lo, did the queen bless us with not one, uh. but two towns and two moons rather than simply the boring one? And lo, did my other side have nothing of interest to preach? I was gonna say, it sounds like a preacher. Today is my day. <laughs> Alright, let's check what the Manny Dex has got. Alright, we need to buy some stuff here. Uh um That is a roll of three for that one. Oh, I just a hammer, yes. Uh, I've got this one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It says two. I've got two. I thought I had this one as well. Um, cheat. Oh, crap. I hit X too, was too soon. Uh, summon the witch of the valleys. And each crystal is worth more, increasing the speed of drawing cards. Lasts for 60 seconds. Oh, I see. That's how many he has on hand to purchase. Uh, hazard. Okay, deck modification. From now on, your deck will st stay at exactly 15 cards. You dealt a bad hand, have you? 
Oh, never mind. Trade it in for a new one with me, old Manny Dex. Can we sell? I keep hitting the left and right bumper, but it's not doing anything. All right. Doesn't look like I can. So let's. Okay. So I, I would think we would only want one of each type of card in its hand, in our hand, right? So we have, I see, we've got. Hammer of two, sword of three, and there's the the bow of one. Okay, so now I can add something new. Each crystal. Yeah, the quick draw. I like quick draw. The sound of that sounds fun. Holy shields even for one hit. Ah, uh, that's got potential in the middle of a fight. There, that one I have to add. Yeah, I've got to add that one for specific occasions. Got the hammer. Critical 20. I don't think I've got that one. Oh, I do. Is there, is there a way to tell if it's... I guess if it's got a zero, it's not in your deck, but... If you have multiples, then it's going to be in there anyways. Wait, if you blink dodge, that da takes weapon damage? All right, we'll just do that for now. Continue. Okay, cool. All right. So now we've got to find, we got to find more bloobs. Maybe he'll tell me where the next bloob is, but if I talk to them. Well, have you gotten the ingredients yet? I have some of them. I need all of them. He means I need all of them. <laughs> Sorry, I skipped ahead a little bit. All right, there's a question. So many words, Ken. Got a oh, okay. I'm wondering if you'll trade me your rarest word. My rarest word? <laughs> That's a tall order. Um, what do you have to offer in trade? This dice. A joke? Let's hear it. How do you get down from an elephant? How? You don't. You get down from a duck. Down, like as in duck feathers. Ah, sorry. Not a fan of puns. No trade. What do you have to offer in trade? Uh, would I have a rare I'm word? Missing? A word to be used when the plane planets alive. A word that describes the process of learning itself. A word that's easy on the eye. It's isom. It means attractive. Isom? It sounds gross. Like you're putting something in your eye. Gross! No thanks. No trade here. What do you have to offer in trade? So is this just going to be a matter of working its way through? I mean, I can't imagine you would give Dicey over. Well, your last one didn't do anything for me, but I'm listening. <laughs> All right. A word that describes the process of learning itself. It's abulescence. It means enjoyment. How does a small girl like you know an adult word like that? Herman and old Junker in one town taught me it. Adlubescence. Oh, learning it is a pleasure. 
the breath of the essence sound, the mouth feel of Adlube. Adlube. Oh, the rarity of it. Oh, this is a word I can definitely sell. Tell you what, I'll give you a great word in exchange to Oblectament. Oblectament. Close. Oblectament. It means Oblectament. a source of delight. For example, learning adlubescence is an oblectament. Thank you again, <laughs> kid. It's a pleasure doing business with you. Bye. It's been an able. Oh gosh. Oblectament doing business with you. Beautiful. Use it well, kid. Ah, uh, shit. Sure. Free sample. Hmm? Halcyon. Halcyon. Uh, that word I've seen so many times and I always would say it wrong. And then I finally started hearing it pronounced like that. And I'm like, oh, yeah. I, I think I always swapped the or added an L. So it was like Hal Halcon. I put a hard K and a hard C into it. Oblectament. It means happy and careless. First one's free, kid. Halcyon is happy and careless? Because I remember it from... Uh, shit. This not I haven't uh, not I don't remember it from shit. I remember it from I think it was Soul Calibur Five or Soul Calibur Four. One of my favorite levels. It was a pirate ship and it was called Halcyon Bay Harbor. I think Halcyon Harbor. It's a great track. I love it. Whenever I was I had to play games with other people, I would always pick that map. They probably hated me for it, but so be it. Yes. Not the one. You. Wouldn't I do. Have a word? Now that's interesting. Oh, what I've never traded nice. in words before. This could be a whole new marketplace. It could be. What's the word? Oblectament. Oh, that is a beautiful word. Oblectament. Oblectament. I would like some oblectament, please. Yes, it is a good word, and that means it has value. Any anything with value, I can trade. Trading oh, words. That's great. an amazing Let concept. Let me compensate you for that word by giving you a gobble, Gregor, in exchange. They're very futuristic. What's a gobble, Gregor? <laughs> Imagine not knowing what a gobble, Gregor is. Oh, I love the Hilarious. bits on the right, side kid. of his mouth, the little stitches. Here's the gobble, Gregor. Just be sure not to use it in full reverse. We all know what happens then. We Thanks, sure. Kid. Do. What, uh, one could grubble Greg anything with this baby. One could also s trade it in the seller street for something valuable. Could I grubble Greg something else? So has the map updated with like new things? That's where the guy wants the grubble, Greg. I think I just have to explore this area and I might be able to find where the other bloob is. But, or there's a bloob right here. Oh, your name is what? Really? Wow. Have you heard any cool bloob rumors? Interesting. I'll keep that in mind. Okay, little guy, in you go. Uh, shut up, Blue. Huh? All right. Yep. Same thing. Most useless thing in random. Uh. So I'm just wondering. It's like, do I have to backtrack for the last Blue? me oh that's right this is where i got the uh one thing over here yeah i got the page over there come on let's see what we can find this way back down there's the creepy wolf ladies. I'm gonna say they're late. They're all ladies. The past few times, it's always referenced them as hers. So 
this my battlegrounds. Oh, can I not? Or this was a dead end, I assume. I'm kind of getting myself almost spun around. I think Manny Dex is down there, and that's the way forward. Or the way back. So that was the key to go through. Yeah, here we go. What's up, Manny Dex? No, I'm good, Manny. Thank you. Manny Dex. AKA Manny Dex. I'm not seeing any green. So I'm going to assume no bloobs back this way. And there's no way to get back up that way. Oh, wait. Good morning, world. It's a beautiful day. My favorite kind. Wait, why is this playing again? Any second now. It too. <sighs> Though I suppose you can't have the sweet. I don't. Without the sour. Ah, uh, very weird. Okay. <laughs> hey, look, now. he's got one of the now money things right there. The Her will is now manifest. Long may she reign. Right, the rules. What a delightful! Way to make a perfectly awful day even worse. I thought that was like a mayor. <sighs> Another dreary day, everyone. <laughs> Just muddle through this horrid life until death finally claims us. Oh, that was the way. Okay, that is was very odd. Almost like it kind of bugged out for a sec. Did it for... Oh, but look, these have come back. All right, well, that's a plus. Is that a way to kind of farm out... Uh, money? Is there one up there? No, it's just... Or did I just happen to miss that one? Maybe I just somehow missed that one? Oh, I've got a card up my sleeve, in my chest, up my nose, up me... Well... <laughs> let's try. <laughs> oh, even? Why are you stuck? Don't get stuck, girl. Let's go. So... Are you already wearing socks? Yes, I am. I mean, the, 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 the motley collection of characters here is quite fun. It is quite enjoyable seeing all the different versions of some of these characters. And, and just the alley is just fun, right? It's got that weird vibe. Sure, it could have been a little more bustling and busy and interactable, but it's not that kind of game. It's not an MMO of sorts. So I can appreciate it for the little bit that it is. And this is the next part to sell. Please, trade the Gubble Gregor to me. I'm sure this skull I'm offering is invaluable. It must be. It's darned old. Let's trade. Thank you. Here. Have this, uh, fossilized skull, I think. Strangely four-sided. It must have come from some sort of ancient extinct animal. Uh. Big Red dug it up a while back before... Uh, forget it. It's not important. But this has got to be the rarest thing in all of Two Town. Thanks, kid. Return. Oh, a three-sided... Uh, uh, yeah, four-sided die. An old, long dead dice destroyed in the purge of the No Dice War. Lisbeth will want to see this. 
Oh, ah, oh, there's the the last blue. I knew that spot had to be for something because it was. Oh, I heard it screech and I got what was in there. Have you two sorted yourselves out? Even decided she'd already inserted herself into the lives of the twins quite enough. <laughs> Boing, boing, boing. Hello, Bloob. How's it hanging? Ah, uh, classic Bloob. Nice weather we're having. <laughs> you said it, man. I'm gonna pick you up. Tough titty, Bloob. I got you. Of course, the question is, which of those two bits do I want to... It's a hard business to be in selling words, but lucky I already traded with yes, you. Yes, I know. I'm good for words, but thank you. Enjoy Oblectament. I am enjoying Oblectament. Adlubescence has given me nothing but Adlubescence, so yes. Words nice. for sale. Well Who done. Wants to buy a word? Here's... Okay, so two out of three side quests done. Only one out of four cards found and one out of these two pages found. So we've got... All right, let's see what this this guy... Well, let's see what to, we're going to do you here. You have the ingredients! Yes. Brilliant! That's all I need. Please... Pass them over. Remember, you did say you'd give them to me. His finger like bends so far back. Let's see. Uh. What? No. I don't understand. I. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it was logical that you would choose me to be the dominant personality. That is what you want, isn't it? Uh. No. You'll need to choose one of us. Who will it be? Uh, the mad scientist. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Oh, just need to mix them together and down the hatch. Ah. Okay. I I feel strange. Oh, oh this is intense. Perfect. It's just me. For the first time, it's just me. Thank you for this. Uh, let me give you something in exchange for all of this. It's my partner's personality. What? Distilled down to its purest essence. I hope it treats you well. You know what? By the cards, I think I'm actually going to miss him. It's so quiet without him in my head. I may actually miss him already. He'd say that's only logical. Isn't that funny? It's funny, isn't it? Ha! Wow. So you got you get rid of one. Summoning a healing bell that heals the dice wielder when she is nearby. The spell that okay. Oh, this thing is just updating all the sides here. Uh, it, it, it's a bit like the Voldemort thing, only. Thank you. Not again. so much. You. Come back to visit me, won't you? It's so quiet here all by myself. So lonely. You even start to miss logic. You miss logic. To miss one like that is not logical. Okay, so... It's, it's kind of, they're showing two question marks here. This is one like right next to the door somewhere. Maybe it hasn't spawned yet. Let's see. 
or it's right or, or it's up and around as I go to the upside down. I have a dubious dubious fossilized skull that I think you might be interested in. Impossible. Let me see that. By the card makers themselves. This is a dice. Oh, rather, it, it, it was, was a dice. dice. It wasn't you who killed it, was it? Oh, if I, I had such power, I would I'm be lurking here to strangers. To strangers. No. no, no, it wasn't me. The queen destroyed all the dice, child. Child. Well, almost. And I was once a man. I want to say thank <laughs> you, child. It's been so long since I've seen a dice, even one that's dead like this. <laughs> that alarms you, doesn't it? Yes, dice can die. We found oh? that out in the No Dice War. You're a warrior? Consider me a concerned bystander. Someone that was part of the, the war, I suppose. Child decided that she should be the only one to wield the dice. And so she waged war on mm. them and on those who'd wield them. And she did not show mercy in victory. If when she finds out there's still a dice and still a wielder, well, she will be apoplectic. Apoplectic. And she is not to be toyed with. I love these big what words, but here? they go over my head. I'll never remember them. Here. I'll be lessons. Keep squeak, whoosh, whoosh. It's not a threat, little one. It's, it's an, an observation. observation. Cleaned from hard-earned experience. Hypothetically speaking, that is. But don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. With me? As for this poor dice... I'm going to return it to where it belongs, to the sacred valley of the dice. I was there. You've been there? I have. It used to be so different. There are some of us who remember the old ways, child. We must stay hidden and we must stay silent. But we exist. Well, that's helpful. The valley is hidden far below random and far from the queen's prying eyes. It's a crypt, a land of the dead, forbidden to all but a few will remember. Remember? I, wager, you don't fully know what you travel with. <laughs> I don't know who you even are. I'm traveling with a friend. I'm glad to hear it. I hope you are. Goodbye, child. Take care and random rules. <laughs> yes, wise to say random rules. Good luck. All right, more. Dice wielder. And you too, little dice. All right, that's four out of five. But I still haven't solved the third. <laughs> I mean, there's the upside down town for sure. I wasn't seeing it otherwise. All right, it's got to be cir circled around somewhere because it's in between the two signs I'm kind of confused as to why that's there or or if it's just like a glitch of some sort but let's go through maybe we'll find it downtown
it's gonna go inception on us. As she looked up, even began to realize the two town's name was easily twice as literal as she'd suspected. They seemed to be constructing a second town. <laughs> what? I've had enough of this job. <laughs> Ouch. It's all goopy. Where's his other eyes? Where did you come from, little one? My Let him go. That's right. You better smart enough and look where you're going, or I. Well, you're very angry for someone so small. I'm not small. You're a big clumsy giant who goes around sitting on my friends. Again, wow, she I is apologize. feisty. It was an accident. <sighs> All right, apology accepted. Look, I'm trying to find my sister. I've got to get through that big old door. All right, hey, now we got to get in a regular talkie. I haven't seen your sister, though. The thing is, I don't see too much of anything these days. And not since the nanny confiscated most of my eyes. Two of them for two town, she said. Ah. Why'd she take him? Nanny Fortuna is the right hand of the queen and has been for oh, years. Oh, yeah. She's as mean as she is old. And let's just say she doesn't take kindly to people borrowing her super pricey mechanical spider wagon. <laughs> uh, the anyway, subtitles went away she for a gave minute. my eyes to the mayor, they disappeared. I haven't heard any news about them since. Wait, I know her. She's the one who took my sister. Or say, that's the monster who just kidnapped my sister. Oh, it seems like we both have a reason not to like her. <laughs> the Civil War and freedom, you know, tried to desert it and got sentenced for treason. I wasn't treason? doing any good there anyway. <laughs> I'm a lover, not a fighter. <laughs> oh, oh. enough about that. I mean, with What's all those eyes, what can you see? Dice. What can you do? I haven't seen a real one in years. I see you're missing a couple of pips, little one. If you're gonna go anywhere. Why can't I simply walk through the door to Threedom? You are new, aren't you? The door to Three Towns forever locked. It keeps the district separate by order of the queen. You'd need to roll a three to open it. And since nobody has a dice anymore, well, they stay closed. But your little friend's so close to three. Yeah. I could fix you, but... <laughs> but... But I can't. Not unless I get my missing eyes back. Uh. Oh, if only a brave dice wielder would find it in her heart of glory to begin a quest to find and return my eyes. <sighs> if I can help you, you'll help me. Yeah, absolutely. Actually, there would have been some cool lore <laughs> going I'm the other one. Nanny passed my eyes onto the mayor. Of course. If she'd given them to the right mayor, getting them back would be easy, but she gave them to that upside down one. Ugh, what a nightmare. Can't I just paint the dot on Dicey instead? <laughs> oh, that's a good one. <laughs> Listen, even if things were that easy, do you think we'd all be here? Heck no! Heck no. We'd all be in six no. town, living the high life, relaxing by, uh, by whatever it is that six towners relax by. I don't know. They seem like kind of dicks. Old, probably. In the... Sadly, it's not that easy, even. <laughs> Especially not since that nanny. When did I tell my him my name? Nightmare of a mayor. So yeah, find my eyes, and I can definitely help you. So, you'll help out, old Seymour. I'll help out old Seymour. Thank you, thank you. Be careful with that two-faced mayor. Okay, if you need me, I'll be over at the town square, near the door to Threedom. Let's see, I've got questions about Threedom. Tell me about it. Oh, it's a bad place. Oh, there's some it's new one animation. Of the six towns, one for each side of the Queen's black dice. We used to be united, but that was generations ago. Before the no dice war, 
Random has seen a lot of war. I like that the, at least the animations have like a personality. So if they need to get down, they can. Tell me about it. Oh, 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 don't <laughs> get me started, kiddo. Oh, the town's being ruined by a family of triplets. It's petty sibling rivalry on a humongous destructive scale with no end in sight. I better go talk to the mayor. Even decided that she felt a kinship with this sad large monster. He'd been hurt by the same people who took her sister. She had it's the true. sense she was the only one who could help him. And she had the sense Seymour could end up helping her too. He looks familiar and I can't place where. I want to say Monsters, Inc. Okay, so he's he's the one that's going to show up at the bottom. And it looks like I just have to go around. The second moon truly is beautiful, and why should we stop here? Things. Camera is not really getting. Whoa, me to change. The mayor. Are you the mayor? I am. Well, one of them at least, and you, young lady, are. About to step on your toes, I am. Well met, even. At last, even had arrived at the mayor of Two Town, the administrator of this land, and the alleged thief of Seymour's eyes. Or at least, even had arrived at his lower extremities. What brings you to my office today, even? I'm trying to find my sister and some stolen You're eyes. You're trying to blind your mister with your swollen thighs? Huh? No. Ha <laughs> ha, she's got to yell. Mine a twister for some colon guys. Mine my sister and some stolen eyes. Grind your... Why don't you take the elevator and step into my office, even? It'll be easier to talk. <laughs> That's clever. He's too tall, so you can't exactly hear him. Or he can't hear you. Yes. So did we officially swap to the new to the other side yet? Don't know if we did, because it didn't feel like it. It's so beautiful, the upside down town. It is beautiful. A shining city in the sky. A shining city in the Do sky. Do you think I'll get to move up there one day? Okay, we're not there yet. The upside down town is twice as nice as I thought it would be. A shining city in the sky. Do you hear that? Oh my gosh, there's some loud noise. Oh, there he is. Oh, that was the mayor. Oh, look at all that stuff. Ah, this is where it's starting to flip and he's like right in the middle of it. You get it a little bit above some. Yeah, there you go. Times it'll let you get a hold of it. All right, let's talk yes, to the mayor. Yes, hello. Step into my office, such as it is. Don't mind the thing sticking out of my hat. He's. How best to explain this? I had a lot on my mind about this upside downtown project. It was starting to get out of hand, and then one day he was just there. Like your other half. Always been here. The darkness? Right. 
We'd better keep our voices down even, if we are to keep this conversation away from his ears. Is that, I'm uh, sure the <laughs> sounded like here, even. the darkness type guy in, uh, personified now. sinuous sacrifice. Be oh, I mean, personalities are getting their own bodies now. That's what Royam is. He's growing out of Mayor my hands and I don't know how to stop him. I don't know how to fix this town even, and I don't know why I'm telling you this. Oh, I suppose you just have a face one can trust. And the plot needs to happen. In any case, what brings you to the mayor today? And he, I like he's not questioning the dice. What's, What's that, that little girl? You want to know how our first past the post democratic system works? Ta Why, I'd be happy to explain it in tremendous detail beginning now. Okay, I think that warded him off. That thing growing out of my hat has a name. Royam. Okay, <laughs> mayor spelled backwards. What? Oh, I never thought of that. Uh, anyway, Royam is my opposite side. He's much more um, self-assured than I am, which normally would be great. But the things he's doing, I don't know if I can support them. Okay. Why are you letting him boss you around? Because he serves the Nanny Fortuna. We both do. Whatever she wants, he's ready to do. And therefore, he I, deserves can actually to be listened to. Really, you can see him. He's my opposite. But at the end of the day, that's the grand thing about two town, isn't it? Everyone's got their other half. It's just like breathing to us. Mostly like breathing. Huh. So what do we do? I have some questions. What's going on with the construction? Oh, that's, um, that's the queen's idea. She wants us to build a second two town. Duality and all that. It'll be glorious, of course. Everything the queen does is glorious. But, uh, well, it just seems to be that it's taking its time to get to that glory and... Well, uh, never mind. I'm speaking out of time. Yeah, construction takes forever. I mean, it's a good thing it's not a highway project, or else, I mean, you'd never, you'd be dead before you see it done. Come on, have a spoin. Oh, the queen always knows best. It's like Nanny Fortuna says, the queen rules by the grace of a black dice, and the black dice never lies. You're gonna have to, like, have a, a b dice battle. Like, where we're playing as dicey. It, uh, it is, yes. It didn't used to be this way. Truth be told, the two-ness in this town can be a little tiring. Everyone being split into dual personalities is what makes us two we are. But building a second city. That flying pile of garbage. That's... Actually, pretty accurate, since it's mostly built out of garbage. Ah! At its best, is that like one craft a garbage? Experiment to test my patience, keeping half of the citizenry occupied with the useless work while the rest of my town stagnates. Oh, but look at myself lose my temper again. That's we a, must trust a nice the angle. Queen's grand plan for us all in our duty to ensure that what she wants happens. In the end, it is all fair, even. Random rules. Of course it does. You're the mayor. I wish it were that easy, even. But... But... I'm just the mayor, uh -huh. and she's the queen. I'm simply not a man of action, even. Clearly. Not anymore. But There's nothing I can do. If the queen's got a means to beat the people down, then you'll that could be a, a tough thing. That's very kind, but please don't. I don't want anyone mad at me, especially not the queen. That's gonna nor happen anyway. Fortuna, nor my mother, for that matter. <laughs> my mother. Oh, bless her soul. Have you seen my sister, no, Odd? I'm afraid not. You're the first tourist we've had in quite some time. Have you considered spending some time in currency down the wonderful Cellar Street? Yeah, I already did that. 
I have. Couldn't miss it even if I want to. Oh, good. As mayor, without I enthusiasm. Me it's like an Elcor without enthusiasm. Oh, good. It's two town where the fun is doubled. So twice the fun. That's something to look forward to. <laughs> something to look forward to. I'm Where's I'm my friend Sawy? Despite my title, I'm in no position to help you. But Out with it. Well, if you dared, you could try talking to Roy I'm directly. I shouldn't even be mentioning his name. But well, you need my help, and this is all I can do. I suspect he knows more than he lets on. I'm lowering an elevator for you even. It's your choice. And good luck. Good luck. We're all counting on you. Oh, shit. That just dropped down there like crazy, didn't it? I, I mean, there's still... Okay, well, let's just get up there. We're, oh, the, we're more or less out of time, but I want to get up over there first. Greetings, my name is Royan. Uh -huh. I'm in charge. You know I'm the boss because I'm so... Uh... Bossy? Big? Big? That doesn't rhyme with charge. You're clearly new at this. You seem to struggle with rhyming. You're very rude to point out my struggle. As mayor, I've got lots of priorities to... Uh, uh, Juggle? Stop interrupting me. I almost had it. Ah! I thought the other guy was the mayor. Him, the mayor? Don't make me laugh. He's less than the smallest member. That gurgling is crazy. Him, the mayor? Don't make me laugh. Yes, I was about to say that. You have met but an idiotic fool. I'm surprised he's not covered in his own... Stool? <laughs> Look, you've broken my flow and made me stop rhyming. I'm busy with the construction of my masterpiece, my legacy, my gift to random of that wondrous second moon, and you're interrupting me. They are uh, rolling what up. Do you want? <laughs> My origins are as amazing as they are obscure. All you need to know is that I am a successful... Entrepreneur. Stop interrupting my poetry! I know you have Seymour's eyes. Can't we make a deal? Why should I deal with you? I am the designer, builder, overseer of the new uh, two town. The better one. Much better than the one that idiot mayor oversees. You want your friend's eyes back, don't you? I said that. So, do you have it? Give him back. Now let's be nice for the minute. Good. Very good. There's something you need to know. Here's how this is going to go. There, you see? My rhymes are getting better. I'm struggling with my poem about the moon. And I oh. like to have it <laughs> Real quickly. You know what? That gives me a thought. I'll give you the eyes, but you'll have to do... Oh, I wasn't... Nothing and not? Ha! You wish. But that's not the prize at which I'll sell. I'll let them go if you teach me how to rhyme. Competently. 
Here's my offer. Take it or leave. Bring me a perfect poem about the moon, and I'll grant you Seymour's eyes. Uh -huh. Okay. Reprieve. Oh, you are good. I come up with the perfect poem. You'll give me the eyes. Yes, that's the deal we have struck. Go find rhymes, and I wish you. I'll think of it eventually. A best of you luck. Do it you before silly. I change my mind. It's only temporarily that our interests are aligned. Parallel to each other. Fail. Farewell, young stranger, and let me give you some advice well earned. Stay out of my way and you won't get burned. Cooked. <laughs> I was about to say that. Wow. It was a mad quest for an insane upside down mayor. But it was all even had to go on. There were some particular propaganda posters hanging on the walls. Perhaps those could be of inspiration. Oh. Go on, Dicey. Good, good. All is going according to plan. I truly am Two Town's greatest male individual. <laughs> Fun. Okay, that's going to wrap it up for this latest episode where we're now in the upside down, not Stranger Things upside down, but the upside down of Two Town and the flipped mayor Roem, Roem, Roham, right there on the bottom. Uh, he can't rhyme no more, so I've got to rhyme for him and I can't rhyme well, so I, sh I wish I had something I could actually rhyme and say well, but I might sit and dwell before I am um, L. Uh, yeah, see, can't do it. Anyway, catch you next time. Bye-bye.